This is Michelle and we are going to Hong Kong today and I thought the craziest shit happened. So I thought the flight namin is 6.50 but it's 10.50 pa na. <laughs> and we realized that almost 1 p.m. na. So what we did, hindi na siya naligo. Tapos nang madali siyang mag-prepare. Ayan, so we are eating kasi hindi pa kami kumakain. And it was my fault kasi akala ko 6 but nakaabot kami it's now 5 minutes before the boarding time ayun lang at is nakaabot kami hindi na namin kailangan magbayad ng new ticket for it so yun lang we're just gonna eat and then I'm gonna update you later so bye We just got our luggage as well. Nakaupo ko ngayon kasi si Jam naghanap siya ng eSIM. And I'm just taking care of our luggages. Uh, we are going to use eSIM although naka-rooming ako. It's just that it's more reliable and convenient. After nito, kaya ako naka-shades kahit na 6.30 na kasi pagod na pagod na yung mata ko. Mukha siyang pagod kasi wala din ako makeup. Naka-skin tint ako. Wala akong lipstick at all kasi nagmadali nga kami kanina. So, after the eSIM, we need to travel for like one more hour para pumunta sa Airbnb kasi medyo malayo yung airport dun sa mismong city kung saan kami mag stay and we will be taking the bus so I'm gonna be putting all the expenses here and kung magkano yung mga pinayara namin Kasi kung kamakaw tayo dito, meron silang kung mas mura Alright, so we changed our mind Kukuha na lang kami ng uh, pocket wifi rental because we can use that dito sa Hong Kong and also Macau because we also plan to go to Macau on our fifth day. So, yeah, it's sixty dollars Hong Kong dollars per day for six days. It's around unlimited data na siya, so it's around two seven pesos, which is not bad. So yun lang. And dito namin siya nakuha. So you roaming paglabas mo ng exit, makikita mo siya agad. Sayin so lang. We are buying some bus ticket to Chim Sha Chui kasi doon kami papunta. Andun yung hotel or Airbnb and it's it's 34.5 Hong Kong dollars. Guys, we just got our tickets and the bus is finally here. It's my dream. <laughs> the ride, yung bus na may second floor. It's finally happening. We just got here sa Airbnb. Now we are preparing para bumaba to eat dinner and also buy some essentials like face wash Shampoo and toothpaste. Let's go. We're looking for restaurants. All right, so that's the sign. Kapag maraming tao, ibig sabihin masarap. So let's. <laughs> the chicken is here and fish ball that's my chicken that's pork lemon cola and then this is mine that's my lemon iced tea this is fried fish obviously na meron mga vegetable Vegetable. 
parang na 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 More of Cantonese. Pero meron na silang banda. Pero kung mga Cantonese. Guys, sobrang daming magagandang skincare brands. Like ito, Neutrogena. Tapos The Ordinary. And dito lang siya over the counter. We just got here sa Airbnb. And then kami sasa to buy some stuff. And I just want to show you what we bought. First one is the di ko alam kung anong brand nakalimutan ko na but my bill is 226.1 Hong Kong dollars that's around 16 anyway this is shampoo obviously i think this is around 4 4000 no 400 wait hindi siya nag focus so cotton we have Listerine. Um, this is toothpaste from Sunstar. I also got face wash from Neutrogena. So, eyelash curler kasi nakalimutan ko yung akin. And uh, this is my first time trying it, Lucas Papau, for lip treatment. Mmm! May bottle. Yeah. Lip, okay. lip treatment. Ang dami kong gustong bilhin, pero pinipigilan ko lang. Yun lang. Bye-bye. After this, I'm just gonna work for a couple of minutes and then minutes. rest. Yeah. Mga 30 minutes. Tapos, bukas gigising ng maaga to work again. And then, full day, I, full day travel or full day tour. So I'm gonna update you kung saan tayo pupunta bukas. Bye bye. Good morning. So we are at. Square something, Square Gardens. No, nasa Central kami kasi dito kami sasakay papuntang Peak Tram. So, mag-uber na lang kami kasi mahaba yung pila sa tram. Guys, alam nyo ba yung mga designer brands dito? Wala lang. Normally, nasa mga streets lang. We just got here. Usually, nag... Uh, nag-hike yung mga gusto mag-hike. Dito na tayo sa The Peak Tower. But first agenda, yung kasama ko is kaka kakain muna kasi gutom na yan. Before kami pumunta ng peak, okay na yung tickets namin. What we're gonna do is eat first. Kakain muna siya. Andito kami sa Burger King. So, currently nag-order siya. And then, after that, buti na lang hindi mainit. Okay. Sa mismong building kung nasaan yung peak, merong mga restaurants. So, it's very convenient. Guys, this is the view. Look at that. This is tiramisu. And then this one is blueberry cheesecake. And then, ito naman is taro. Masarap, but I don't think $88 is worth it. Guys, we are riding the tram. Ang ganda, parang kami nasa. 
sa ano, Jumanji. Para kami nasa um, Jurassic World. stations dito and if you really want to use the public transport you have to make sure na marunong kang magbasa ng directions and hindi ka yung laging nawawala because it's gonna be harder for you and kung magisa ka lang tapos you don't know how to read the directions good luck um, kung ganon dapat marunong kang magtanong sa mga tao like Hey, where's the MRT station or this this is station? Because <laughs> nung nasa Korea ako ganon ginawa ko eh, hindi ako na wala. Kailangan mo lang gamitin yung bunga ng mo. Buti na lang, I don't I don't need to use that. I don't need to do that because I don't even need to use my brain anymore because someone is doing it for me. <laughs> Guys, ito yung park na lalakaran mo. Pupunta sa MRT station. Guys, low bat yung Digicam. So, umuwi muna kami para mag-charge. Kasi malapit lang naman. And then, we will go to K11 Musea to get some coffee. And, i-visit ko yung Castify. Kasi may Castify pala doon na store. And gusto ko nang palitan yung case ng phone. So, okay, guys, we're here and we found Sephora. Tapos, ito yung muna ko nakita. Rare Beauty. So, guys, Tarte is also here. They also have Fenty here. And Makeup Forever. Alam ko may magandang brand or magandang product yung Makeup Forever. Guys, dyan tayo pupunta sa K11 Musea. This is matcha spoon. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Cinnamon. That's why I already started eating the pastry. This is the ham and cheese. Grabe. Oh my gosh. Lots of sobrang sarap. Paid around one eighty six Hong dollars. That's around one three pesos for five pastry. This one is the matcha matcha spoon. Mm. What? Try it. Frozen grapes. Frozen grapes. Because I was about to buy um tasty pie kanina. Pero yung gusto kong, isa lang yung gusto kong case doon. Kasi ayoko yung sobrang, yung sobrang daming design. Pero yung gusto ko, it's worth 5,000 pesos. I don't want to spend 5,000 pesos plus for a case to buy. Or for a case. Or a phone case. Tignan nyo yung foods niya. This is my lunch. Para siyang egg na may chicken. Tapos, this one is a refresher. Hindi pala siya egg. It's potato mash. Mash potato. Guys, we are at Victoria Harbor. So, nag-book ako sa club no Victoria Harbor Yacht Experience. And yung schedule namin is 6.30. It's now uh, magsi 6 na. So we are just waiting for the yacht. I think ito siya. Anyway, 
Ayan, I'm so excited kasi yung lights later. I think ito. Is a I'm going to be showing you the lights later. Sneaker Street. Kasi gusto kong bumili ng bagong shoes. Kasi ang sakat-sakat ng pa ako. Anyway, it's overwhelming. Ang daming brands! Wow! Let me show you. So this one is called... I don't know. Pero maganda yung shoes nila. Ayan, Converse, New Balance, Adidas, Timberland, sobrang daming Adidas. Cool, so cool. Kasi ang sakit na lang pa ako and I'm gonna wear it now. So nice. This is how it looks. So nice. It's my most expensive shoes. Oh my gosh, that's so nice. Look at that. Hey friends! Um, it's already, it's 9.45 p.m. already and I just want to sit down because I want to answer all of your questions about the immigration, my experience with the immigration officers, etc, etc. Now, wala akong masyadong ma-share kasi honestly, paglabas ko ng Philippines, isa lang yung tinanong sa akin. Kailan ka babalik? <laughs> so, yun lang yung tinanong nung nasa Hong Kong ako, walang tinanong direction na agad. So, I know a lot of you are asking me about, you know, my experience sa immigration because some of you maybe first time you palang na alis and also you're a freelancer as well. Nung first time ko na umalis ng bansa, going to Bangkok, Thailand, I just, uh, yun na lang yung ishare ko sa inyo, uh, mas applicable siya. And also, wala naman akong vlog before about, you know, Thailand nung pumunta ako doon. But, Madaming tinanong sa akin, okay? Kasi again, that was my first time. Plus, I am a freelancer, so ang tinanong sa akin is sino yung kasama mo? Of course, sa ko kung sino yung kasama ko. Ikaw ba nagbayad ng ticket mo? Of course, ako yung nagbayad. Can I see your bank account? Pinakita ko yung bank account. Do you have any company ID? Sabi ko, wala kaming company ID because all of us are working from home. But, kung okay lang, I can show you our website because I have my website myself. And then, pinakita ko doon na, okay, this is my agency. And then, registered kami sa DTI and BIR. So, pinakita ko rin sa kanya yung DTI and BIR ko. So, nakita niya yung bank account, everything, mga documents. As long as meron kang um, flight na papunta at pabalik, okay yon Dapat meron yun kasi tinitignan nila yon plus yung saan ka titira. So, dapat merong confirmation nung hotel or let's say nagbook ka sa Airbnb or sa booking.com or Agoda. Dapat may mga confirmation yun. And yun, never pa naman ako na-offload. Never pa akong... Alam mo yung intense interrogation? Kasi lahat naman pre-provide ko or lagi kong pino-provide. And also, nung first time ko is, hindi ko iniisat na ma-offload ako. Kasi I'm very confident na wala naman akong gagawing shady or whatsoever. So, you just have to be confident and dapat wag kang pa-otal-otal or dapat... You have to make sure na lahat ng information na binibigay mo ay hindi pa pa iba-iba. 
So that's pretty much it. Um, usually, ganun lang. Also, my second time going out is ganun din. So, yun lang. Hope that helps. Good morning. It's 11, past 11 a.m. And it's our third day. So today, pupunta kami. Ano na pa ng babe? Basta yung merong, yeah, Big Buddha, yung merong cable car. So, um, we're just gonna look for foods sa MPR. Kasi madaming mga, ano dun, bibilhan. Gusto mo? We can also be using the octopus. Tang tong chunga, multiple two adults, and then let's put them. The card. Okay, engineering card. Guys, super efficient. No public transport nila dito. Kaya okay lang na ano, magcommute ka every day. Tapos parang optional na lang yung Uber kung tinatamad ka na mag-commute. Pero hindi siya nakakapagod at all. Kasi walang singit ng singit, walang traffic, walang makukulit. Kasi kung may ganda lang sa Pilipinas, ibibenta ko na yung kotse ko. Like yung efficient. Efficient na public transport. Like... Ito yung mga MTR or MRT, LRT sa ano. Actually, dapat yung mga subway eh, para mas, mas maayos. Wishful thinking. Guys, first order of business. We're gonna eat first because... Gutom na ako. Kanina pa ako nagugutom. And then we have outlet, store outlet stores. We are ordering the beverage. We just one. Guys, we're eating. Nasa labas kami kasi wala kami kainan. Wala kami mahanap na food court. Buti na lang hindi masyadong mainit. Around 28 degrees Celsius. So, okay lang. Ito na lang kami sa labas na kain. Anyway, ito yung foods namin. Tingnan mo, meron palang Shake Shack dyan. Hindi namin nakita. Ngayon lang. And ito yung lemon soda na sobrang sarap. Ito, yung oat milk latte nila. Okay lang. Tapos andyan yung dock. Pakita mo, babe. Oh, it's so good. There. Oh, it's so good. We're in City Gate. Then there's a lot of outlets. Dito yung ano yung napanood ko sa TikTok na madaming designer brands na yun yung outlet nila. So sobrang mura lang. Guys, sobrang haba ng pila. Papuntang cable car. Kahit nasa club na bumili ng ticket, it's the same. Buti na lang kumain kami ng marami. Because I need the energy para sa linya na to. It's too long. Ano ba't sabi mong mahaba yung pila? Oh, patience is key. Patience is key? Patience is key. Oh, I don't have that. Oh, ang haba pa rin ng pila. Experiencing the 
Motion 360. Hi, one chocolate egg tart. Chocolate egg tart. Yeah, and then one venti strawberry acai with lemon. Guys, pauwi na kami. I mean, pabalik na ng Chim Sha Choy dun sa Airbnb. Tapos, we'll look for an available, yeah, yung magandang ka coffee shop later para mag-edit ako ng videos and just chill para meron kaming energy bukas for Disneyland. Guys, papasok ulit tayong city gate kasi mag-anak lang tayo ng kung anong pwedeng bilhin. Sa Bath and Body Works kami to see some scent. And also, we're looking for yung refresher ng, ha ng house. Yung ito. Oh! So, and also checking some scent. O oh, meron sa mga bago. Hmm. Inaamoy ko yung vampire blood. I think bago nila yun. It's sweet. It's fruity. Usually, magkano na to? Basta mahal to. Pero ngayon, nasa 180 pesos na lang siya. 24 US dollars. No, 24... 24 Hong Kong dollars. So, I'm gonna splurge. Kasi, may mga ganto na ako. Hindi ko siya nagagamit kasi umas na. No, okay lang yung... I'm gonna get... Mm. Oh my gosh. A thousand wishes. This is my favorite scent. Kukuha ko. Siya pa noon na. <laughs> yeah, ilalagay niya yun sa condo niya. Anyway, we're just gonna shop and then I'm gonna show you later kung ano yung binili namin. Yan yung mga ano, scent na ginagamit namin usually. These are everything we got. Bumili ako ng mini hand gel. Ayan. Tapos, ito mga air freshener. Tapos, ito naman. Air freshener pa rin. So, for the room. Guys, nasa coach um, outlet ako. And I'm trying to look for this bag. Sobrang ganda niya. It's 1485. I'm just checking. Oh, okay. Is it okay if I take a video? Yes, yeah, sure. Thank uh -huh. you. So this is originally six thousand Hong Kong dollars. Now it's just one four eight five. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Okay, but ano kayo malalaman nito? Okay, so I found another one. I found ba to? All right, so I found another one. Um, we got this bag right here. 15,000 na lang siya, guys. Can you believe that? Pero nakuha ko na yung isa kasi. So, I'm thinking if I will be getting two. And then, this is the other one. Hello. Hi. I absolutely love both. Okay. I decided I'm gonna get both. I'm gonna get both of these. All right, we got the bags. This is the first one. Okay, just checking it. This is so nice. Guys, we got the bags. Like, literal bags. Kailangan na namin umuwi para hindi na ako bumili ng kung ano -ano. Ito na yung last na bibilin ko, babe, ah. Ito na yung last na bibilin ko. Promise, this is the last product or item that I'm going to buy. Ito, dito kami kakain ng dinner. Oh, Hindi na kami magka-coffee shop. Guys, nasa Mawiki kami and uh, sobrang punong-puno yung restaurant. I think it's either it's because it's weekend plus masarap yung food. So, again, kung kupuno yung restaurant, ibig sabihin masarap. So, we're gonna wait. Actually, pang number 13 kami. Pero, tinawag na yung number 10. So, malapit-lapit na rin kami. I'm so excited. Meron tayong 
beef, diced beef with potato. We have chicken, Thai chicken, chicken with Thai herbs. We have fried rice. Ano daw yung best seller nilang fried rice? We have braised duck. No. Braised pigeon. Thank you. Yeah. And then we have yung lamb bahat pot. There's a lot of foods. Kain lang kami ng dinner. And then after nito, I edit ko na yung videos. And then that's it. See you tomorrow ko sa Disneyland because it's gonna be a long day. Kailangan namin na. Kailangan na ba yung dinner?